Right now, the French government is paying Holocaust victims around the world as part of a recent agreement between France and the United States. One of those people lives right here in the Bay Area. But now's Nicole Grigg with her story of what her family went through and her plans for the money. I could have danced all night. At 85 years old, Betty sings whenever she can. The tunes remind her of her father. She says it was his singing that kept him alive through the Holocaust. My father used to sing for him, and he liked that. So he would throw him a piece of bread. This is how he survived. At nine years old, Betty's father was transported from France on the French Railroad to a detention camp. While well, Betty hid for four years until her father was released. Papa! I recognized him even though he looked like a skeleton, like this. 75 years later, the Gulf Coast Jewish Family and Community Center in Clearwater helped Betty get restitution for what her father went through. It was an award for Holocaust survivors and their families. And in return, she's donating a portion of the money to the agency that helps 260 Holocaust survivors in the Bay Area. They were hoping that I would be dead already. I could have spread. A lot of survivors call it blood money because of the guilt of being considered one of the lucky ones to survive. In our misfortune, we were lucky. I'll never know. For the now, I'm Nicole Grigg.